Hi, James. Hope you are well. Uh, Coach C, we'll start with an opening statement, and what, then we'll uh, get over to you for questions. So, Coach, whenever you're ready. Thanks, Nicole. James, I appreciate you being on, and I just want to say how awesome it is to, to get that win and to send our seniors out, um, Danny Faye, Kennedy, and, and, uh, and Logan out on such a high note. And, you know, those kids, our team, and those seniors have worked incredibly hard all year. So for us to, to go out and, and, and get that win against a great Minnesota team, um, just a great day and had a lot of fun too, honoring, you know, our three seniors at the beginning of, of the game. And yeah, just a, just an awesome day for, for our kids, for sure. James, if you want to just unmute yourself, you're totally good to ask questions since you're the only one on here. Okay. Um, congrats on the win, Coach. Thank you. Uh, Speaking to me. Um, so just first off, what can you say about um, Vanessa Oatley's performance on the mound today? It was quite impressive. Oh, impressive to say the least. I mean, I I call her our hype queen. I, I'm sure you can you can see why. But, you know, the, the one thing I, I love about Vanessa is she's always going to go out there and compete and, and give it the best that she's got. And today, you know, she just did a great job of, of keeping their hitters off balance and did a good job of mixing her pitches. And, and we also got, I also got to say just great job to Allie Curlin because I thought she she did a fantastic job for us behind the plate. But yeah, Vanessa came in today and, you know, she wanted the ball and she was ready to go when we gave it to her. And um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm proud of Vanessa and for uh, and Allie and to keep a team like that to one run and especially after what they've done, you know, off of us this series is is huge. And, you know, sometimes the, the fourth game um, the offenses tend to hit a little bit more and Vanessa found a way to shut them down and we held them to one run. So, yeah, just a great day and, and just proud again of Vanessa. Mm -hmm. And. In the three seniors that are leaving, what is what is this team losing going into next season? What do those players bring that the next season you're going to miss out on? Yeah, you know, they're just a great group of kids. Um, and I think all three of them are just so different. But I think it was the best thing for our team because they led in different types of ways, you know. But we're definitely going to – anytime you graduate seniors, you know, they're, they always bring great leadership and, and, and positive energy to the team. So – um, yeah, we, we will definitely miss Danny and, and Kenny and, and Logan, but I know that they're all going to do great things once they leave here at Penn State and first and foremost, because they're, they're just awesome kids. They're going to work really hard and, and I'm, I'm excited to see where their, where their futures uh, lead them. So, but we said it today and I'll just say it again. They know that they always have a home here in, in Happy Valley. Mm -hmm. And you have so many returning starters like Curlin, Morrison, Livingston, um, Bailey Parshall, Lingenfelter, and Vanessa Oli. What do you feel that's going to contribute to next season where you're, you're not, you're only losing three players, but you're coming back with so much that you, you were able to build off? Yeah, definitely a positive, right? And, you know, it was, it was a good year from a getting that big 12, big 10 experience that, that they need to have, right? And um, that's the most important thing. And in a lot of our kids, they didn't have any, they didn't have any real big 10 experience. And, you know, when you think about our junior class and our seniors, they were only freshmen the last time they, they played a full conference schedule. So um, I think it's huge and looking forward to all that group coming back. Mm -hmm. And what's something this season that maybe not have panned out that you're looking to improve upon going to next season? I know it's a bit early. I mean, you know, we're, we're looking to improve in, in a lot of different things. And, you know, obviously we, we need to get stronger from an offensive standpoint. And, and, and I think in all aspects, and I think our kids, I think our kids know that. So, you know, I'm excited, honestly, for, for our off season and, and our fall season and our kids have worked really hard, you know, they need to go home and, and just take a break, but um, I'm just looking forward to getting them back and, and starting training for next year. Cause next year is going to be a great year. Mm -hmm. And finally, just overall, how do you feel about your first season in Happy Valley? Uh, yeah, it's been a challenging year uh, for for a lot of different reasons, but it's also been a great year in that. And, and I say challenging and, and I speak I'm referring to the COVID piece of it. You know, I, I don't really even know what Penn State actually is because I, I haven't seen it. So I'm just so excited to get through COVID. And I know one thing that we have here is great people. I'm surrounded by great people, uh, some of which I've only met on a Zoom call. 
Um, but I'm excited to, to get things going again. I'm excited to, to, to meet people. I'm excited to see what Penn State's all about. And honestly, going into next year, I'm just excited to be able to spend more time with our student athletes and, and get back to normal just from a team standpoint. So, um, you know, I, I love it here at Penn State. I know even through all these challenging times, this is where I'm supposed to be. And I'm excited to, to, to build a great program here at Penn State. And and, and I know that that's what's going to happen. So looking forward to the future and, and looking forward to just, you know, getting past this, getting, getting through COVID. Mm -hmm. uh, that's all I have. Congrats on a season coach and look forward to seeing you guys again next year. Awesome. Thank you, James. I appreciate it. Have a great day.